Hello everybody, welcome back to your 16th Python tutorial. In this video, I want to talk about the else statement. So the else statement is attached with the if statement. So you might call it the if else statement. Hopefully that makes sense. So basically what an else is, is it basically returns a value if the if statement comes back false. So in the previous example, let's look here, we set age to 14. And then we do a test. If the age is less than 18, we want it to print this. And it did print this because age 14 is less than 18. That makes sense. But what if we wanted to say something if age is over 18 at the same time? So it runs a test. And then let's say age is 14. It says you're too young. And if age is 19, it says you are welcome. Or you can use this program. Or you can come to the club or whatever it is. Well, that's done with the else statement. So let me show you that right now. We can just bring this down here to retype. And then we press enter. And then what we have to do is to end this block, because remember this, this print is all part of the if statement, we need to press backspace, okay? Now we press else, we type else, and put a colon. So how this is set up is we have an if statement starting at block 1. Ignore these three little lines, that's just saying the start of the program. So basically, if and else are lined up, and then this is a block within the if statement, which that needs to be indented so Python knows that it's part of the if statement. The else is not... The else will not be ran if this runs true, so it's a part of a different block. Both of these will only be ran if age is less than 18. So that means we need to go back a block, put an else statement, press enter, and then within this block we say print welcome, good gooder. All right, so now what we do is we press enter and it'll run the test. First let's look at the value of age. The most recent definition of age was 14. So it should still print these two. So let's try it. And you can see it prints both of those. Now let's reassign a value to age. Let's make it 20, uh, 345. Wow, it's an old man. Alright, now we take take this, bring it back down here to rerun it. And we can press enter and you can say, welcome, good dear. That's because age is greater than 18. Uh, I know this video is pretty simple, but that's all I really have to say for this one. So hopefully the, uh, you'll stick around to the next video where we will be explaining more in depth how the if-else statement works. So thank you for watching. Be sure to subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.